Hey guys, it's Mark Weens here in Bangkok, Thailand, and I am at probably my favorite restaurant in all of Bangkok. It's called Lan Ruam Thai. And so my, my wife Ying, she is from the south of Thailand. So I guess, I guess you could say that I have a severe addiction slash obsession with Southern Thai food. Uh, Southern Thai food is my, one of my favorite cuisines in the entire world. So marvelously concocted and I have just ordered up probably the three most uh, comforting, most pungent, and most incredibly awesome Southern Thai dishes. Um, I like to call it the glorious trinity of Southern Thai food. This one is Geng Som, which is a sour curry soup, and this particular version is with fish and with um, coconut shoots. This broth it is basically a combination of turmeric, chilies, and garlic and lime juice. One of the one of the ultimate Southern Thai dishes is called Geng Tai Pla, and this is actually a fish bladder curry. You can see that rich dark sauce, uh, but there's bamboo shoots in here. There's like roasted fish, and then finally, one of my go-to dishes called Pazata, and this is these little beans here. They're known in English as actually stink beans, uh, but they're common in the south of Thailand and very popular in Malaysia and Indonesia, known as petai. Okay, so first I'm gonna try some, some of the geng som and let me dig out a piece of fish plus some of that gravy, plus some of the soup and some of the coconut shoots and then put it onto my rice and It's spicy and salty and sour from the lime juice. I can taste um, I can taste the fresh turmeric root in there and those those coconut shoots I actually I actually like them even better than bamboo shoots. They're they're more tender. Um, it's almost like a like a crunchy jicama or something like that. But that soup is just spiced to perfection. A beautiful concoction. Geng Tai Pla is one of the powerhouses of Southern Thai cuisine. Um, and it, it's one of my favorite dishes in all of Thailand. And I think it's one of probably one of the, the spiciest dishes in all of Thai cuisine. I love it. So I guess the best way to describe Geng Tai Pla would be, it's almost like, like chocolatey, fishy gravy, infused with chilies, and it will just light your mouth on fire, but with the most uniquely pungent and awesome flavors one could possibly experience. And finally, the Pad Sata, uh, also known as stink beans in English, but it really is a healthy, healthy, amazing little morsel of a bean. And this has always been one of my obsessions, my secret pleasures, the stink bean. It is just... Such an incredibly sensational flavor these beans have, and they're fresh and crispy, uh, but cooked in a with some pork and with like a, a curry sauce that's made from turmeric and garlic and lemongrass, and it just hits all dimensions of your taste buds. Oh, that was 
just speechlessly awesome. So Southern Thai food is known throughout Thailand as being some of the, the hottest food in the country. Um, and it's not, just a, it's not just a little kick of chili. Properly made Southern Thai food should be like an internal inferno that just like burns your whole body. If you do not sweat profusely or get a runny nose, the food is definitely not made to standard. It's called Geng Nai Pa. I am more than happy right now. My stomach is bulging. Whoa. Whoa. I actually have a roll on my stomach right now.